Hello everyone, thank you for watching. Today we are talking about Nuke from Heroes from Eldering Twitter. Warrior and Prisoner Warrior, a nomad warrior who fights wielding two blades at once, an origin of exceptional technique. We know Warrior was in closed network test, so I'm going to talk how he was presented in network test. Given that, some things could be different on the release date. The Warrior is a dexterity based character that uses agile and acrobatic attacks to deal with enemies. At close range, equipped with a buckler and a medium armor, the Warrior's default skills allow for projectile style sword storm attacks. Warrior starts with two scimitars. You can attack with both or only one. Skill on scimitars is called Stormblade. Works pretty well with this character because this character lacks range. Later, you can get bow because bows usually have dexterity scaling. Strength of this class is dual building to crank up damage quickly. Downside of this class is because with dual build weapons we cannot parry nor block attacks. If you decide to pick this class and you are struggling, I would recommend to pick a shield until you feel safe to proceed with dual weapons. Eldering Twitter describes this class as a prisoner bound to an iron mask. The post also reveals that this class studied in Glinstone Sorcery and that he lived among the elite prior to sentencing. In this image, there are no hints at starting equipment of this class, but from description we can see that this class aims to be great starting point for magic builds. Considering its Glinstone Sorcery background, the prisoner will likely have high mind and intelligence stats, mind expands FP, focus points so that we are able to cast more spells. Intelligence enhances quality of spells and increases maximum capacity for FP. Thank you for watching, hope you enjoyed it and I would like to hear your comment.